Daily Mass Readings and Reflection August 10, 2023 Feast Day of St. Lawrence, Deacon and Martyr First Reading 2 Corinthians chapter 9 verses 6 to 10 Brothers and sisters whoever sows sparingly will also reap sparingly and whoever sows bountifully will also reap bountifully Each must do as already determined without sadness or compulsion for God loves a cheerful giver Moreover, God is able to make every grace abundant for you, so that in all things, always having all you need, you may have an abundance for every good work. As it is written, He scatters abroad, He gives to the poor, His righteousness endures forever. The one who supplies seed to the sower and bread for food will supply and multiply your seed and increase the harvest of your righteousness. Responsorial Psalm Blessed the man who is gracious and lends to those in need. A reading from our Holy Gospel according to St. John chapter 12. Verses 24 to 26 jesus said to his disciples amen amen i say to you unless a grain of wheat falls to the ground and dies it remains just a grain of wheat but if it dies it produces much fruit whoever loves his life loses it and whoever hates his life in this world will preserve it for eternal life Whoever serves me must follow me, and where I am, there also will my servant be. The Father will honor whoever serves me. Today's reflection for our Holy Gospel. Unless a grain of wheat falls to the ground and dies. Today, we take a short break following the Gospel of Matthew by taking a passage from the fourth Gospel. This is to highlight St. Lawrence, deacon and martyr, whose feast we commemorate today. Although still in his youth, Lawrence was among the seven deacons who served the Church of Rome in the mid-third century. During Emperor Valerian's persecution, Pope Sixtus II urged him, being the steward of the church's property, to distribute all the remaining goods to the poor. Soon he was arrested, tortured, but remained steadfast in his faith. In torment, he exclaimed, My God I honor and him alone I serve. Therefore I do not fear your torments. This night shall become as brightest day and as light without any darkness. Lawrence realized in his life what Jesus says in today's gospel. He was like that grain of wheat that released its tremendous potential to be incredibly productive. He allowed himself to fall into the ground and die and thus brought forth a lasting legacy of service to the church and faithfulness to Christ. In the end, he reaped the harvest of eternal life. 